it's time to train bouldering. Bouldering on the competition nowadays is a lot about coordination, flexibility, but if you really want to be strong, you have to climb on a spray wall. Spray wall is basically a piece of wall which is fully covered by holes. Good ones, bad ones, crimpy ones, slopey ones, anything. And in a very little space you can create 10,000 possibilities on a thousand holes. I've been training on coordination style bowl problems a lot, but if I only did the coordination style bowl problems, I think I would get weaker. And that's why spray wall takes a big part of my training. Every week some progress, that's nice. So this is Kotelna, it's kind of my training laboratory. Uh, most of the holds that are here I set myself and I, it kind of looks like a chaos but most of the holds has its certain row, you know, it's just right there where it needs to be in order to like kind of like create so many different possibilities. Sometimes it's when I change some of the setting on, of the wall, change some of the holes, it's really hard for me to fall asleep because I keep like thinking about the new possibilities, new ball problems. It's just, this wall has thousands of holes but it's got million possibilities. And every half a year or every year we just take everything down and put all the new holes. Climbing on a spray wall is a great training for any experienced or even intermediate climber. I would say it's the most natural way how to get strong. And I believe it's much more important than doing dead hangs, campus board or pull-ups. He says every move is powerful. That's what the spray wall is usually about. <laughs> That's why it's so efficient that you can gain like quite a lot of power only because you climb and not doing like specific training really. You just go bouldering and you get power on, power on the way.
This ball problem is from two weeks ago and I think I had like no chance to do this 360 move with like this one move in. Like this one move in makes it like so much harder to spin around and now I stuck it and I was really close in the second part in 360 so it would be cool to link this first move and then do the rest of the boulder. Even though spray wall is actually a really old thing, today in the age of modern, nice, shiny gyms, it kind of ceases to exist. And that's why I encourage all the gym owners, please offer us some small but high quality spray wall in your gym. Oh.